What's good people, Sim Football Critic here with a real quick video. We're gonna showcase some feedback here, show something that you know definitely can be improved as well as something that's done fairly well in this play. Now, we're gonna take a look first at the area of concern, you know, the area of improvement, and this would be on the offensive line. As we take a look at number 64 here. Now, I like the fact that, you know, he recognizes his target, you know, he goes back into his pass coverage, but what you're gonna see happen here is once the defensive player you know, Steve McClendon here seems like he gets out of range and then the offensive lineman acts like he doesn't know what he should do. You know, and in no case scenario should he do what he does here, here in the game. You know, he turns his back and he just, it looks like he gets lost. So I definitely want to see improvement in this area, you know, as far as player sense and just allowing these players to really play out, you know, the outcome or play the situation realistically and, you know, make more human-like decisions because I just really can't understand exactly what he's doing here. You know, I don't know if that's a flaw or a glitch or what have you, but again, you know, just constructive feedback here to pass on to the devs. Now, on to something that I think was done very well here in this play. You know, it could be argued as far as animation and things of that nature. But let's take a look at this for a moment. Look at how Cortez Allen knocks this ball out of the receiver's hand. You know, and, and these are things that I definitely want to see in Matt. You know, and, you know, of course, I want to see more DB and wideout interactions, more fighting down the field, fighting for the ball, hand fighting, jostling, you know, whatever you want to call it. But things like this is definitely welcome. You know, as you can see, he's looking at the quarterback. And, you know, there's a little moment here where I'm not sure, like right there, I'm not sure why he's playing to the inside there. But, you know, luckily enough, he did react to the ball once the ball was thrown. Plays the receiver the whole time. And you're going to see, you know, he basically watches the receiver. You know, again, right here, I'm not sure what that little hesitation step, you know, why would he step inside? Not really sure what, what was going on there. Um, but I definitely like what I see here, as you can see, reacts to the ball. And once Nate Washington goes up for the ball, Cortez is going to go up, knocks the ball out of his hand. You know, like I said, it could be argued about the animation or what have you. You know, some of you may like it, some may not. But the outcome and the result of this play is definitely welcome. And I got to give credit here where credit is due. Definitely like to see stuff like that. All right. So guys, like always, let me know what you think. Every Tuesday night, the Sim Perspective Radio Show, the show for the Sim Gamer. Give us a call at 347-202-0388.